the arterial stiffness. This morning, preparing myself to this lecture, I went onto the internet. Today, 2016, the March, and of April the 1st, and uh, I saw that uh, 10,100 papers talked about in the PubMed regarding the arterial stiffness. What it means? 10 years ago, it was almost 1 to 1,000 papers. So the paper about the arterial stiffness are increasing dramatically. Why? The arterial stiffness is uh, talking about and dealing about the uh, rigidity or flexibility of the arteries. Basically, under the term of arterial stiffness, we are talking about the aortic arterial stiffness and aortic wall characteristics. Briefly, the more elastic, flexible the aortic wall is, the lower the aortic pass velocity. In the contrary, of course, if the artery is uh, hardening and the wall is getting to be rigid, so-called stiff, this means that the aortic pass velocity will increase. Today, according to the European Society of Hypertension and European Society of Cardiology guidelines on the management of the arterial hypertension, we do have a robust evidence regarding the importance of the measurement of the arterial stiffness. Basically, it was issued for the hypertension, but we do have data that although in diabetes, and in general population and the end-stage renal disease, the measurement of the aortic arterial stiffness is getting to be more and more important. Why? Because uh, the long-term prognostic trials showed that the increased aortic stiffness and increased aortic pause velocity is in connection and in relation to the adverse cardiac outcomes like cardiovascular morbidity and mortality. So the prognostic power of the arterial stiffness measurement has been proven, and uh, this is very important to reveal and to estimate the individual cardiovascular risk. All of the papers and all of the sh data showed that the arterial stiffness and the aortic pass velocity is the independent measure of the uh, arterial stiffness and independent measure of the increased cardiovascular risk. What it means that compared to the traditional risk factors like smoking, cholesterol, systolic blood pressure, age, and uh, the gender, despite of these facts, uh, if the aortic pass velocity is high, independently of the traditional risk factors, it carries prognostic importance regarding the adverse cardiac outcome. So, to measure the arterial stiffness, today had become an essential part of the medicine, not only in the cardiovascular field, but even wider.